Injuries like ankle sprains or muscle strains will likely affect us all at some point in our lives. When they do happen, what should you do? People will often apply ice, take anti-inflammatories, and stop doing activity for a few days or weeks, hoping for optimal recovery. But is that really the best approach? Past approaches to managing injuries have used acronyms called ICE, RICE, PRICE, and POLICE, but they only addressed short-term care. Introducing PEACE AND LOVE, a new acronym to guide you in rehabilitating injuries. The PEACE acronym is for immediate care after injury. P is for protect. Unload or restrict movement for one to three days to avoid aggravating the injury. Protect a little bit longer in case of a more severe injury. E is for elevate. Elevate the limb higher than the heart to help with swelling. Despite weak scientific evidence supporting its use, elevation is safe and potentially useful. A is for avoid anti-inflammatory modalities. Inflammation is the first step in recovering from injuries. Blocking these important mechanisms may be detrimental to long-term healing. Most people are convinced they should apply ice. However, icing is not backed up by research. Ice can help with pain, but could potentially lead to impaired recovery in ligaments and tendons. C is for compress. Taping or bandages can help with swelling and bleeding. According to research, compression after an ankle sprain can help with quality of life. E is for educate. Therapists should educate patients on a personalized active recovery instead of passive modalities such as ultrasound, manual therapy, or acupuncture. Avoid overtreatment. Set realistic expectations about recovery times instead of chasing the magic cure. LOVE is the acronym for starting rehab, generally a few days after injury. L is for LOAD. Put more weight on the injured body part and resume normal activities as soon as symptoms allow. Loading without exacerbating pain builds strength in injured tendons, muscles, and ligaments. O is for optimism. Negative emotions after an injury can sometimes explain symptoms more than the actual severity of the injury. While staying realistic, be optimistic about your recovery. V is for vascularization. Pain-free aerobic activity should be started soon after injury to boost motivation and increase blood flow to the injured structures. Cardiovascular exercise improves physical function and reduces the need for pain medication. E is for exercise. Restore mobility and strength to reduce your chances of re-injury. Don't push through pain and let your body guide your progression to harder exercises. Recovery times vary according to the severity of the injury. Trust your body and listen to it. To get personalized advice, please consult a healthcare professional.